Well, here's a look at the river at Kimmel Park in Vincennes. This was shot by our Bureau Chief Gary Bryan, whom I affectionately call Gary the photographer because he does such a great job at uh, shooting. And that duck's going backwards. There he goes. It was a duck, wasn't it? Kind of looked like one. At any rate, that's the Wabash River at Kimmel Park down in Vincennes, and the river is on the rise. In fact, all the rivers are on the rise. Here are some river stages for you. Uh, Montezuma cresting on Saturday. Same thing for Clinton. Here in Terre Haute, uh, the crest will be at 23 and a half feet on Monday. Hudsonville at 22.6 on Thursday and Vincennes 21.2 on Friday. That's next Friday, a week from today. White River levels cresting mostly on Sunday, Monday, except down in Petersburg will crest on Thursday at 22.6 feet. And then the Embra River, uh, St. Marie, uh, cresting tomorrow at 17, or 19 and a half feet. And on Sunday, down in Lawrenceville at 33.6. So rivers are on the rise, and there's a possibility we could get a little bit more rain. A cold night tonight. Uh, overnight lows tonight dropping down into the uh, 20s, I would believe. And then for uh, Sunday, it's going to be warmer on Sunday. And then next week's weather, we're looking at a chance of rain on Tuesday and then a chance of rain on Thursday. Storm Team 10 has been, uh, we've put our heads together about this. So we're going to keep an eye on this for you. I'm not going to blow it up for you, but it's possible next week. I'll keep an eye on that for you. Temperature trend, look at this. So today we got up to, well, the, the upper 30s, uh, low to mid 30s. Then Saturday, 26. Sunday 50, Monday 57, and Tuesday 59. This is very typical of, of February. You have cold days and then you have warm days and cold days and warm days. And usually in between the transition includes some sort of precipitation. Well, no precipitation tonight, but a cold front is going through. So overnight lows tonight, Paris 13, uh, Darwin 17, Clinton 15 tonight, Rosedale 15, uh, down in Vincennes 21 for the overnight low, and in Newton 18 for the low, Oblong 18. Uh, tomorrow's highs, not a whole lot better than what we had today. Tomorrow's highs in the 20s. Take a look at these. Uh, pick out your town. You can see Brazil at 23. Um, we have Vincennes at 29, Linton 27, and only at 28, and Newton at 25 tomorrow. So what's happening is another cold front coming in. And with that cold front, we have some clouds coming in tonight. So you can see how about midnight or so, see how the clouds come through and the wind now starts to come out of the northwest. And this is a cold wind. And because of that, we're going to have a breezy day tomorrow, but a sunny day tomorrow. So that's the way things are shaping up for us tonight. The forecast then 15 for the overnight low, some cloudiness and a cold breeze at times with that wind out of the northwest. That wind could gust to more than 20 miles an hour. So it's a breezy and cold night. And then for tomorrow, a high of 26, mostly sunny and a cold north rest, uh, northwest breeze, though, up to 25 miles an hour. So it's a cold day tomorrow. And then for tomorrow night, 18, clear and cold, not as breezy, though, an overnight low tomorrow night of uh, 18. Now look at this. See, the wind is from the south tomorrow night, 5 to 10. That's going to help bump that temperature up once we get to Sunday with a high on Sunday about 50, Monday 57, Susie. Uh, some people have Monday off, by the way, because it's uh, Washington's birthday. Not officially, but with the government, it's Washington's birthday. So it's a holiday. So, you know, there you go. It's a nice day. Talk about a